Hi guys, Mr. Rough Waffles here. There is a new Season 2 gameplay trailer. Season 2 starting next week, by the way. And a little birdie's told me that this features Outbreak, the mode that's been rumored for like a week now, and is going to be coming in Season 2 at some point. It's a large-scale zombies mode. Treyarch have been giving us little teasers for it on Twitter as well, showing us a room that really looked like Kino at first. But as I said in my video, I actually think that it isn't Kino. I think that it was the Ural Mountains thing that had been being teased instead because of the large scale of the outbreak, outbreak, sorry, outbreak, sorry, that had been 0% contained, and there had just been a load of other things that have been leading us up to this moment, so we're going to jump into the trailer right now, break it down, check out what's coming for us in Season 2. I'm super hyped about this, so uh, drop a like on the video, and uh, let's get into it. And if there's a copyright song, I am going to probably have to bring the levels down a little bit, so don't worry about that, that is being done on purpose, because I don't want to get a copyright strike, okay? Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh! Okay. Okay. Well, there was a uh, mimic. All right. So this is stuff that we've seen already in the little cinematic trailer. Rats are here. Oh. And so it begins. Oh. Hold on, Rebus. We are inbound. Okay. I have you, Beagle. Yo, hold up. I'm about to sit, dude. It's go time. Okay, there's the copyright music. Maybe we can just talk over it, dude. I'm gonna bring it down a little bit. Okay, so this is the sort of thing that... Wow, okay, yep. This looks really cool, actually. I'm liking the kind of Shangri-La vibe of this area, I'm not gonna lie. It looks awesome. Dude. Okay, so that's what they've been teasing. That whole... Wow. Okay, it looks massive. That's the scaffolding that we saw in that in that one teaser. There's the chandelier. Okay. Vickle looks sick as well. Oh, he's got the... <laughs> he got the thumper. Okay, so... This is... This is very cool looking. There's a lot going on. Oh! Oh, oh he didn't look happy. Oh! Here we go. Outbreak. So... Oh, man. Get to the specimen analyzer. We can't risk losing this data. Oh man, okay. Get that rover to the breach point. Dude, wait, what? There's monkeys in cages, bro? What? A new one adventure? The, the dragons from Dyson? What the? All season long? With the. Uh, I don't What this guy? What? <laughs> Bro, what? Hold on. We need to go back. <laughs> In the words of what, whoever it was, like, I don't know, Hudson or something in that one Black Ops teaser. We, is it? No, it wasn't Hudson. It was a Russian dude or something, right? We need to bring him back. <laughs> like, dude, let's go back this bit. Squat up an outbreak. All right. I w Seriously. Huh? All right. So they're coming in here. You know what? Let's actually whack this onto the one and only big up YouTube 0 0.25 speed. Alright, the sound is not so hot, but we've got zombies coming in here with, like, this guy's looking like he's just walked off a set of Peaky Blinders. And there's quite a lot of them, but then we see this. We, like, bro, did anyone see this? Okay, did anyone see this coming? Co yes, actually, realistically. I was going to say no one saw this coming, but it's been leaked for a week. So, yes, people sort of saw this coming. But prior to the leaks, did anyone expect that we would be getting an outbreak mode? Where, like, like big, big team humans versus, like, massive scale zombie, like, uh, war zone, but against zombies. There's, like, loads of zombies chilling down there at the bottom of the cliff as they go down on their little buggies here. This looks awesome. They jump down there. Okay, and then I want to see... So there's, like, there's a drop or something in the background on that shot. That looks really interesting. I wonder if that's meaning that we're just going to get our regular drops, or is that something else? Because that green looks kind of weird, to be honest, to me. Like, that looks like a different kind of green to the uh, standard power-up drop. So I don't... I mean, and then it explodes, so... I'm not sure exactly... Oh, no, it's not exploding. It's something else exploding. And then there's this stuff! Like, bro, is that a keeper head in a jar? <laughs> like, 
th they're fighting in this little room here. That's like a ski resort map. That looks that looks very uh very familiar. I've certainly been been to a ski resort or two in my time when I went went to the mountains last year. <laughs> What's going on in that? Is it just a it's just a zombie head? It actually looks like Sergi's head from I was gonna say D Machine from Firebase Z, sorry. Alright, so you've got the you've got the zombies looking all grotesque here. And they're just they're not even really attacking the player. Like this zombie is literally like he's not even T-posing, he's like he's just chilling. He's just chill. I don't know what he's doing, to be honest, but that zombie's just in there. There you go. There's Sergi's head in the little containment containment thing. Looking very spooky. Loot fight survive what a tagline what a tagline for a mystery mode that no one really understands right now loot fight survive sounds like a plan to me chief and then this thing starts coming out requiem's own lunar lander like they're putting the mars rover on the freaking on the verdansk map that they're going to be releasing the ural mountains i mean isn't there like a isn't there a rover landing like today isn't that happening it's turning to, it turns out that it's actually landing next week except it's not just any old lunar lunar lander not any mars rover it's got uh, it's got monkeys in it for some reason uh, can anyone explain to me why this is a thing i'm not complaining and this looks very blackout by the way as well have you noticed that guys like obviously verdansk is like the modern warfare take on big team battle royale style environment and things like that in a in it from a call of duty infinity ward kind of lens but this to me looks like the treyarch style that akami was originally talking about in the outbreak leak where he said it was in a a, a, a treyarch style large scale pve game mode this looks like it's ticking all of those boxes very blackout-esque but it's pve loot fight survive I'm intrigued by all this, and again, like, you've got the the, the, the the scale of the world really being illustrated by this, I think, as well. You've got the storm in the background there. This all looks very, very blackouty, blackouty to me. I mean, in a new Undead Adventure, the, the thing that's nuts is, like, Blackout died for this. <laughs> like, Blackout's sacrifice has led us to this day where we have a Zombies map releasing, and mere weeks later... We have another, not just any old map releasing, but a new thing for zombies that has never been done before. I mean, this is incredible. I'm actually so excited for this. That zombie's getting absolutely shrekt there. He's trying to throw his guts in the in the player's direction. Not going to happen, buddy. Nuh-uh, not today. We've got this really interesting light that we saw before, and obviously the DE dragon here looking crazy. Like, the fact that that is back is bananas to me. The war heats up. Okay, I actually didn't read that the first time round. You've got the nukes in here, the CCCP nukes on there. You can scale in and out. That's cool. Show me more in the environment. You got choppers. You got. Oh man, look at look at the scale of that world. Look at that. You're gonna be able to explore all of that. Can you imagine the amount that we're about to learn about the zombie storyline, about what's going on in this new dark ether universe when when we've got this much of a world to explore? Like, bro, yo, shout out to Codename Pizza for the <laughs> the myth busting on the next video, dude. Like. It's crazy. I'm actually blown away that they're doing... Like, that this even exists in the first place, to be honest with you. They've got, like, some kind of sort of Russian architecture thing going on there. you got your, your operators kind of infiltrating this little facility. And they are taking down... Okay, so we've got to be, we've got to be careful here not to get mixed up with what's Outbreak and what isn't. Because when they're taking down other players like they are here, I think that this is not Outbreak anymore. Let me know if I'm wrong in the comments down below if you disagree with that. Um, but to me, the implication is that that is Verdansky stuff. And then the outbreaky stuff was more when they were specifically showing zombies in action. Loving the look of those death machines, by the way. They look fancy. Very fancy. Players getting taken down there. Nice little bit of action going on. Some really cool finishes as well. My boy gets thrown into the literal hole with the nuke. What is this? I said Lunar Lander before, I'm about to say it again. Like, touchdown, boys. Houston, we have a problem because they've actually, like, what is, what is that? And that's what's got the dragon on it. So you're feeding these machines, I guess. And that's probably going to be some kind of objective that gives you, I guess, Ethereum, maybe. And then, bro, you've got this whole area, like, inside the Dark Ether. It looks like this door is a portal. 
it certainly seems like it. That's like an old style portal, similar to the ones that we've seen previously in things like, I don't know, like a Revelations, for instance, where it's just a rectangular portal instead of the older sort of style of, or the newer style, sorry, of having like a circular portal like in Firebase Z. And you've got your heavy zombies there too, looking really spooky. You've got your motorbikes in the zombies mode as well. Bro, I can't wait to run through a horde of zombies on a motorbike. That's going to be incredible. And then this boy... Hello, my boy's even got the headphones that I'm wearing. Maybe I'm destined to be a panzer in, a, in, another, in another life. Maybe this is one of my ancestors, dude. He's also got some interesting, like, swamp grease on him. Some, some like, jelly jelly going on here. I wonder what that, what that means. But, bro, panzers are in Cold War. And you know what that means? That means that in future DLC, when we inevitably go to Kino der Toten, remade into an East Berlin map... Remember, I'm telling you this now, guys, in a month's time when the teasers start for that East Berlin map coming in March, no, sorry, April, coming in April, what are we going to see in there? Most likely, we're going to see Panzers, because they've built the enemy, so why not? Why not, dude? Actually insane that the Panzers are returning, breathing fire, and then we see this at the end just to wrap it all up, top it all off, the moon in the background in classic zombie style. I mean... Guys, if you're not excited about all of this, the fact that out of the blue, Treyarch have done something that they have never, ever done before and sandwiched an entire new big team zombies experience between their regularly scheduled maps. I mean, I don't know what to say to you. I'm blown away, personally. I think this is absolutely incredible. And I mean, there's, there's stuff happening for Verdansk and for Warzone, as you can see. There's stuff happening... For zombies, of course, there's multiplayer stuff coming. There's Samantha as an operator coming in season two. There's all sorts of stuff. So the fact that this is a free content update is incredible. The fact that this is coming at all, like I would pay for this. It just the fact that it's coming is 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 so damn cool to me. I love it. I'm very, very excited. I think that Treyarch have done a really incredible job here. There's actually a little bit more tease beyond this little title card. So don't click off the video just yet. This is the outbreak map. You've got a little train line here. Bro, are we going to be seeing any hints to transit? Because transit certainly had a train system running through it. You've got the purple fog in the background as well. You've got these little buildings here looking very suspicious. I want to explore them. I want to see what all sorts of zombie storyline secrets are, are hidden in all these buildings. And this is a little bit more of the more of the kind of town area. I'm just I'm just thrilled. I'm thrilled that this is happening in the first place. Wait a sec. That zombie has a Christmas hat on. What does that mean? Why is it? I knew there was going to be something hidden at the end of this trailer. Why does that? Obviously, in Jingle Hell, zombies had Christmas hats. Are we going to get a Christmas in July event? Like, are we going to get a Christmas event just because Christmas sucked this year? <laughs> like, or last year, either, uh, rather? Like, are we going to get an, a, a new Christmas thing happening? Or is that just like a fun thing that Treyarch have thrown in there just as a joke? Or is it taking place at Christmas? Like, what is the deal? I mean, I think this looks absolutely incredible. This whole thing. Also, this is all snowy. And this looks very different, to be honest, to the other... Like, this will look snowy, but then this doesn't look sort of that... I mean, is that snow? It looks a lot less snowy. So, are there two things coming here? Like, I need more info. I need more details. And as soon as I'm able to make, like, a what we know about Outbreak so far type video, I'll be doing it for you guys. So, expect that to come very soon. I'm going to be working real hard to get a load of videos out for you guys this week. I've also got so much content on the way. I've got like a top 10 papped guns video that's going to be on the way. I've got a video that's like, I'm going to be starting weapon guides fairly soon. So if you're excited for that, then smash the like button and whew, there's just so much coming. I'm so excited. So yeah, drop a like if you've uh, if enjoyed the video, guys. Subscribe if you're new as well and I'll see you guys next time. Bye for now. Wow. Crazy stuff.